Hello again, you hoops. This is Beanie Bum. And uh, if you've been watching my video, uh, I only mentioned it in my trials video. But if you've been watching my videos, I've mentioned that I played Guitar Hero, or I've started playing Guitar Hero more. Uh, again, so I recently just bought this guitar, which is awesome. And but I noticed that like, and this happens with every single Guitar Hero guitar that I've used. Um, the blue button stops working, like it gets really unresponsive and you have to press it really hard in order for it to work again. So I was like, hmm, and seeing how I built a computer, uh, I decided to take it apart and see what was wrong with it. So, um, I took it apart and via deductive reasoning, <laughs> not really deductive reasoning, but through observations, I noticed that like, there's a screw here, right, that keeps this little motherboard chip thing down that registers where the buttons are pressing. And then there's a chip here. Come on, camera, focus. Focus, camera. Ah, oh, whatever, he's not gonna focus, or she, I don't discriminate. But anyway, so since the screws are being held down at only two places, um, when you press the green button, this doesn't move all that much. Let me try and clean off the lens, it's all blurry and nasty. Yeah, it's better. Okay, so you see how that doesn't move? Now when you move to the buttons in the middle, like the blue, you press it, and oh that's my phone, sorry. You press it and it moves a lot. So my solution is duct tape. And I, I've got quite a bit. Let's find that water bottle. My room's pretty fussy, I should clean it. Anyway, so I'm gonna duct tape this thing down, maybe somehow, I don't know exactly how, or maybe put something behind this backstop so that when I put it together it pushes down harder on the blue, and then that should be able to fix it. So if you have this problem, that should work. Okay, bye bye and thank you for watching. Hey, so I know I said bye in that last clip, but I wanted to give you an update on how my little fix worked, and it worked amazingly. As you can see, five stars on, um, what's on? Oh yeah, this one. This one by Ramstein, the one I can't pronounce. Good song, I like Ramstein. So anyways, what I did was, I took some of the duct tape, I took out, uh, like long strands, right? Uh, about, uh, I, maybe I can hold it with my teeth. No, that doesn't work. Anyway, so I took long strands about the length of this, and then I folded them in half lengthwise, and then folded them, and I did that about, like, twice. Put them down, and then duct taped it. Then, that made this protrude out, so I screwed it down really, really tight. As you can see, this is thicker than last time, or maybe you, you don't know, I don't know. Um, but there's tape over here because this is actually protruding a bit but because it's holding it down so hard um, but it works greatly everything is super responsive now even the buttons that I didn't have problems with before actually work better than they used to I would recommend wearing gloves when playing by the way too it gives you more slide uh, so yeah thanks for watching and I hope this helps you if you still play Guitar Hero <laughs> bye bye